Yo k o s o Japanese Quest to it. Welcome to Japanese Quest. Today, the journey deeper and deeper into the Sword of Trials continues. This is a channel for learning Japanese from Japanese games. I'm your guide, Akita Sensei. But、uh, it's not just me. Anyone else watching, anyone else chatting, anyone else who follows. Imagine this is a multiplayer RPG type of game. But when we level up, we level up in Japanese and in the game. So, welcome. Yokozo.、Uh, I have a feeling that immediately when I get <laughs> to the next level down here, it will be dark and. I'm just gonna get killed by a guardian in the dark or something like that. k o w a i desu yo. Ko. Wa. I. Kowai. Kowai means scary. Whatever is down here, I do not know, but it is kowai. And、uh, that's what we do in Japanese Quest. We kind of find words that are in the game, but some words, like these words here, doyobi, nichiobi, we didn't all find them in Xenoblade 2.、Uh, they were suggested by other party members over here. So if you suggest words, we can add those to our power level. This power level can go up. One day, even hasenijo, over 8,000, or in, over 9,000, the English translation. So, Rowdy Monk. Dark Shibara, Japanese Quest, that's me. Yokozo. Japanese Quest to it. So if you find words, sentences, you can suggest them down in the chat there. And、uh, the whole idea with this channel is if it's just one video game character, at least to me, that's a little bit boring. But if you can imagine it as a metaphorical journey. Through not just Japanese games, but also the Japanese language. And it's not just one Japanese teacher, but it's potentially dozens or hundreds or thousands of party members, each bringing their unique perspective and experiences, combining their powers, but then kind of building up this collective party experience that anyone can then come in and draw from. Anyone can come in chat and just find this word. Some seven year old kid can come here. Ah, key, tree. Maybe they're a seven year old kid. They learn things really quickly, so they just learn all these words. That is the goal, at least. Sa. Yikimashou. Sumo san, konnichiwa. I like your emote. What is that, a rabbit? Usagi san desu ne. Kawaii. Is there any more treasure here for us to pick up? We can't pick that up. Ah. レベルアップしましたあ、そうですかどうやって How did you level up? Sumu san there is saying in the chat that they leveled up I'm wondering if you mean leveling up in language or leveling up in a game On Japanese Quest we kind of try to do all of the above level up in the game level up in the language level up in Twitch as well So if anyone here is a streamer who streams Japanese games Mention that so we can、uh, help level you up on Twitch as well. So let's do a real quick review of the food we have. So we have some food. Oishiso desu ne. Kemono niku. Tori niku. Tori is a bird, so tori niku is like chicken, usually. Lingo is an apple, but、uh, yaki ringo for、uh, like grilled apple. And we have some weapons. I forget what level we're on. Can we check somehow? Hmm. Sumo Sen says, I meant Japanese power level leveled up a lot since I watched. Oh, really? Yeah, we have leveled up quite a bit recently. We needed to in this dungeon because we're in the Trial of the Sword, and this power level must get up for us to have a chance. Sometimes we just yell out random Japanese words to increase our power level. Because that increase. I am. This character Link here is powered not just by my mediocre skills at video games, but also by the power of language. 
Did you enjoy Pokemon Quest? Yeah, I think we'll probably play it again sometime for like a side quest, maybe outside of the main time. Yeah, I've actually played it a bit off stream, which I never, I never really play games off stream, but it's kind of fun, kind of like an addictive kind of like game to play a little bit every once in a while. Ah, Frankie, konnichiwa. Okay, shall we go? I think we're ready. We're probably gonna die down there. Let's make sure we have a decent weapon. Daijobu kana. Ah, got it. Konnichiwa. Minna. Kyo no tenki wa do desu ka? Sumo-san says, I started playing Okami. By the way, I just asked, how's the weather, if you want to answer where your weather is in your part of the world. It's cool because we kind of have a full global representation on Japanese quests. It's cool to hear where, how the weather is in different places. Kyo no tenki wa do desu ka? Koko de wa atsui desu yo. Amerika de wa atsui. It is hot here in America, kind of a broad place, but that's where I'm located. And uh, Suma says, I, I started playing Okami HD, and it's quite nice, plus has Furigana. Ah, nice. Good suggestion. We may play that sometime. Ah, Maklo, konbanwa. It's winter here, but still gets hot. Ah, so desu ka. Naruhodo. Yosh, shall we go? I have a feeling that death awaits down here because we're in a place that's dark and you just get attacked in the darkness and now I'm not warmed up. Let's get warmed up. So the thing I never do is use shield but I think if you use shield how do you do these different dodges? So I just never do it. Well, so they shot the... I forgot how to do our dodge moves. But anyway, if you target someone, you can then attack them, which helps a lot in the dark. I was finding. Yosh. Ikimashou. Frankie says it would be great for this channel. Yeah, the one thing... I l I'd like to find some more games that have more voice. Like, this game doesn't have much. But it's nice if you have the Japanese voice, too. Because as much as I like reading everything, it's cool if you have some Japanese native voice in there as well. Uh, let's continue here. But yeah, it does look like a cool game. It would be fun to play, I think. Okay. I think we need some hype to go down here. Because it's going to be dangerous. I'm going to bring the dragon. We might need uh, some hype from our new emote, Bucket. It's a tier 3 emote, so it's hard to summon. But there's some Bucket hype. Let's do this. Yosh! Ikimashou. Dark Shibara, arigato. I think with the power of the dragon, we will hopefully make it. Problem is, we always get attacked immediately in total darkness. Daijobu kana. So, which buttons are which? I'm forgetting the buttons now. That's not good. Kakura, let's hide. Get a sense of it. Eh. Nani kore? Yeah, Sumo san, that's an interesting um, point. I think you're probably right. That would make sense in a way, logically. So I realized I never used it before, but we could use this tool to see people in the dark, I think. You'd think that you could see enemies. So I can't see anyone, which makes me kind of worried that there's something scary out there. Daijobu kana. Eh! Kawaii! Whoa! Yup, buddy, it is a guardian just like I thought. Is it just one guardian? It better be just one guardian. Ah! Konnichiwa.
Oh. Are they saying I can't freeze this guy? Eh? It seems like you can't time freeze this guy for some reason. They're not allowing you to do it, I think. Maybe because it would make it too easy? I don't know. It's very odd. You can always time freeze these guys. Oh, you can time freeze him. You just can't see him as yellow. Oh, I guess... It time freezes him very briefly, it seemed like. But it doesn't want to give you... I guess, night sight? Okay. This looks really dangerous, actually. Hmm. Well, we could fire arrows, I suppose. And then hide behind cover. We can start with that. Get a sense of his timing, at least. Whoa! He shot very unexpectedly, so he didn't have to do a full charge. We could have died right there. Yeah, it seems like he has an unpredictable firing pattern, and he doesn't seem like a normal type of guardian, which is bad. He's normally good at killing these guys, because they're all kind of the same. So how long is he stunned? Oh. Okay. Uh. Quite. Should we try an electric arrow? Did anyone notice what floor we're on right now? I did not notice. <laughs> so let's look at the items. The cool thing about this game, you see all these verbs when you're just looking at items too. Like so, sobi is to equip. Uh, denki is electricity. So denki no ya, electric arrow. Ya means arrow. I'm really not sure of the best way to fight this guy, but I feel like engaging him front on. Whoa! Phantom Pickle has summoned a dragon. Let's get some dragon hype in the chat. We need a dragon right now. It's dark. They could bring us some fire. Yatta. We got a dragon. Suge. Kakui desu ne. Dragon has been summoned. Hold up. Meet the Gazette. He will help us on this beast. So I noticed there are bombs all elsewhere too, but I'm just kind of scared of anything that can kill us in one hit. Whew. I just have no idea sense of this guy's timer. So he's kind of super frightening. Yup, we got a dragon. Um, how come there's two different kanji for dragon? Two different kanji for dragon. Uh, one is the more, like, old traditional version, and one is the more, the newer simplified version. Other people may have different, um, suggestions too. Dream Proxy says, hello, just lurking. Uh, I don't know any Japanese, but it's still fun to watch. Yeah, this channel is kind of designed for all different levels, so if you know, don't know Japanese, all the better. You can just look and see a word like this. This is something we need right now. Hikari. Light. If only with the power of Hikari, we could do something here. Hikari. Light. So yeah, anyone just joining who uh, might not know any Japanese words can check out the words there. And yeah, Dream Proxy's been here before. Yatta. Glad you like the blue bar. Yeah, those are all the words that we found earlier on Japanese Quest. So that seemed like it stunned him for ichi, ni, san, shi. Perhaps four seconds? Ah! Anime Senpai-san, konnichiwa. If anyone knows a better strategy to fight this guy, by all means you can mention it, but I'm just trying to do the method that won't die, because we're pretty far in this already. Ooh. 
Ooh, yeah, see, I feel like a, three, a few shots and then it will fire on us. Um, Phantom Pickle says, yeah, I've been lurking as well for the last couple of days. I've been learning Japanese the last year, and I'm finding this channel pretty helpful. Yatta! Ureshi! Isho ni nihongo de gamaro. And let's also defeat this guy. Yeah, this is a great place to suggest ways that have worked for you to study Japanese, because it can really help inspire other people. Even if they're not in chat right now, they could be watching this on YouTube a year from now and think, ah, that method that someone that Phantom Pickle mentioned? That could really work for me. Because everyone learns in a different way, so we like to encourage people where they are, what they're working with. That is the hope with this channel. The idea is we're kind of just on a journey. Imagine us all on a hike together up the Japanese Mount Fuji and kind of all just casually suggesting strategies and different fun things we like to do with Japanese. And then having fun taking these guys down on our way up Mount Fuji as well. I think I might have missed, so I don't want to try that again. Shlo winner! Ah, konnichiwa. Moskoshi. Seems like we can beat this guy with this method, so we might as well. Seems fairly safe. Hope he doesn't get angered. Yosh! That better be the only one. Yatta. Kachimashita. It was worth it. Take your time. Just like when you're learning language, sometimes you need to be patient. Don't rush things. Just slowly chip away at it. Part of what we do on Japanese Quest is try to make everything into a metaphor for learning Japanese. Eventually, I want to make a highlight reel of all the different random things that are metaphors for learning Japanese. Whoa, I don't want to get burnt. <laughs> so it sounds like there's no treasure here. So the winner says, slowly consuming you, driving you mad. So it looks like this is another way to fight this guy, but I'm scared of those because we were killed by one. Ooh, we have some boxes. If this somehow kills me, I'll be very angry. Did you like that video I, I sent you on Discord? Yeah, I did like it, Anime Senpai. Like I suggested, I think if you suggested, if you put that on the video channel, some other people might enjoy it as well. Good to see you, Anime Senpai. Konnichiwa. Also, Schlewinner, Omniscient. Minna. Konnichiwa. Ettone. I'm just so scared of these bombs. Sumo Sundra says that Pokemon Gold demo that got leaked is pretty fun. You can ride a skateboard. Eh, so this guy. Omoshiro so. Taimatsu Iranai. Taimatsu means torch. I learned this word when I read Harry Potter, the Harry Potter series, because you see that word, <laughs> Taimatsu, torch, a lot. So if you ever read the Harry Potter books in Japanese, you will learn this word. Or you could learn it in this game. You have a lot here, too. It's not a word I really saw that much before reading Harry Potter, to be honest. There must be more treasure somewhere. Ah, go away. These dark levels have really no treasure. I don't know why. 
So no one noticed what floor we're on? Because I think this thing has 16 floors. I'm just wondering how far we are. Ah! Suge! 100, just a small question. Uh, let's assume I sit in front of the PC and say I'm going to grab some food. Grab some food. Some other people in chat might have a good way to say that. Uh, I'm trying to think of the best way to say it. Etone. It's funny because that's like such a basic thing to say, yet in Japanese it's not something I've said a lot. So yeah, basically like getting food in the kitchen and come back. So yeah, like Omniscient says, you could say it the way that you said it. But I feel like often people would add like an itekimasu, like I'll be right back kind of thing. Yeah, that's the kind of thing that I was thinking, something like that. Some kind of itekimasu, like I'm going but I'll be right back. My internet friends say it like this. Tabemono otekimasu. Thanks for the perspective of mission. So yeah, that sounds good. I find that when people in chat often say they're going to go for lunch or something, like when Shuo-san says it, they'll often say itekimasu at the end of it, like I'll be right back, or leaving but I'll come back later. Or yeah, motekuru, I'll get it and come back. Okay, shall we try the next level? Let's see what we have for our weapons. Oh yeah, no, it's no confusion. This is a good, the kind of discussion that's that's helpful to everyone because there's different ways. There's a lot of different ways to say something. And sometimes it can be, can be confusing because all those different ways to say it kind of collide in your head or you're not sure which one's the best. And oftentimes all of them are kind of okay. So it's good to just discuss and see different ways to, uh, to say something. Yoshitsugi wa... Yosh, ikimashou. And hyakubetto, arigato. Thank, thanks so much for the hundred bits. Ikimashou. More dark. Quite. Cool. Ooh, I think I hear a giant. We have to fight a giant here. It sounds like. That's sounds scary. Did anyone notice what level we're on? I still don't see what level we're on. <laughs> so we're probably fighting one giant, and he's right there. Kyojin, so does net. Okamijin. Or maybe you could call them an ogre. They're kind of like an ogre too, like... Anta says, like, Tsumu? Yeah, that's a good word. You don't 
Um, I wouldn't say you'd use it in that case. Kore nani? We got some barrels. Hmm. Kind of curious about all these. So Frankie, you wrote ten. This is challenging because I can't even see this guy. I hope there's not going to be a bomb that's going to kill us somewhere. Should probably just use our strongest weapon. Maybe our attack buff too? Ah, uh, level 10? Naruto. Yeah, it doesn't work. I guess it kind of works once you activate it. Okay. Okay, I think we want some decent arrows on this guy. Um, and we can shoot him in the eye. Maybe some fire. Failed. Bob and I. Okay, more arrows, perhaps standard. Now let's bomb him. No risk on this guy. Not risking it. Yosh! Kachimashita. Yatta. Still don't know what levels we're on. <laughs> don't know what level we're on, but hopefully um, we're doing okay. We got a bolt rod. Kishino Kenzo, decent sword. And then Kishino Yumi, so decent bow. So let's throw away some things that are not so great. Okay, did anyone notice yet what level we're at? I have no idea what level we're on. I'm always so scared that I don't notice the level. But we must be getting down there. So we've had now a Guardian in the dark, a Hinox, we've had Lizards in the dark. Ah, uh, level 10. Oh, that's what you're saying. Sorry, Frankie. Pakaras ne. I've been uh, mixing, missing what level you're talking about. So we're at level 10. Okay, good. So 10, 10 out of 16. Yeah, I hope so. I hope there's another treasure room. I don't know if there will be, but I would think there might be. Because the first treasure room is pretty early. I hope this is a treasure room after this. Because this is kind of like a boss. That went pretty well. Ah, yep, that. Get some of our arrows back. Yeah, this is what's called the uh, the, the trial of the sword. Tsurugi no Shiden. Tsurugi means sword, and then Shiden means trial. So Tsurugi no Shiden. 
The Trial of Swords. Or the Trial of the Sword. And we're in the, uh, the middle level one. It's been challenging. Okay, I think that's about it. Ikimashou. Let's just do an accounting of what we have. Let's again equip a sword and a shield and a bow, standard arrows. Time freeze. Okay. Yosh! Ikimashou. But yeah, this is the ma a master sword challenge. Ashiera. Good to see you. Konnichiwa. You can see a dragon in the top right because we had a dragon summoned earlier. It's a Japanese quest. I believe Phantom Pickle summoned a dragon. Which means they subscribe to Japanese quest. Yatta! You were right, Maklo. How long will Zelda streams go on for, do you think? Uh, we will beat the game on Saturday. 8 o'clock Central Time. 8 p.m. Central. Or no, yeah, 8 p.m. Central. Two fairies! We better get one of these fairies. Last time we saw a fairy, we missed it. I missed to practice my form. You think hopping like that's bad? Yosh! We have one fairy! Hokano... Eh, did it fly away? No, it's there. I failed so hard on the first one of these. There, there's one fairy, missed it. Luckily, we didn't need it, but we need both of these. It's gonna get a lot harder, I'm guessing. We must swoop in when the time is right. Does anyone know the proper technique for getting a fairy? Fairy is yose in Japanese. Yosh! Ureshi. We actually got it this time. Both of them. Still mad for not getting it the first time. But now at least we have a little bit of a uh, security blanket. Yep, there are fish in the pond. Um, I got some of them already. Hmm? Yep, we'll cook it. Kuri-sensei is here saying that there's fish in the pond, so that's what I'm talking about here. There are fish. Sakana ga imasu yo. There's treasure over here. Let's get some treasure. Kiraku. Open. Moribito no Ken. It's the forest. Forest sword. Uh, Anta. Yeah, that looks like it could work. For your sentence down there. I think often the wa wouldn't be there though. You could say like doyobi watashi ga ie ni nai, but I think either way it can work. Ooh. Haria no fuku. Got some more armor. Let's make sure to put that on. It's the last time I forgot to put it on. Finally, we have some clothes. Kakuine. Different color too. It's the first time we've had clothes like this. Ooh. Moribito no Yari. So the forest spear. I think that's better than some of the spears we have here. Ooh. 
Yashi no Mi. So Yashi is coconut. Treasure anywhere? Hmm. Night is now. So let's go cook. Ooh, there's some apples. Bingo. Savage for life. Still working on those trials? Yeah, right now we're kind of deep into the. This Trial of Swords. How many have we done? Right now, I think we're at like level 11 of the intermediate one. We just went through a bunch of darkness levels. So, kind of in the middle. It's time to cook. Ryori shimasu. And Savage! Konnichiwa! O genki desu ka? How are you doing, Savage? Good to see you. All right, let's do some cooking. Te ni motsu. So when you cook, this is what you do. Te is your hand. Te ni motsu to hold in your hand. So if you hold it in your hand, then you can cook it. Or you can just eat it, taberu. But if you cook it, you get twice the effect, generally, I think. Te ni motsu. I'm doing well. Ryori. See this word you see down here? This for cooking. Ryori means to cook. Ryori suru. To cook. Ryori, ryori by itself means like cooking or cuisine. Ah, Greg. Konbanwa. What a coincidence. We're doing the same thing. Guzen desu ne. But can you cook this fast? That is the question. Link's pretty good at this. <laughs> Yosha Yakiniku Kinoko. So you got some fried or grilled meat plus mushroom skewer. No, it didn't even get to the microwave yet. If only we could cook like this. I would cook all the time. <laughs> I'm kind of scared they gave us two fairies actually. Makes me think that they'll make these next levels like super difficult. So I think if this is 11, we have 12, 13, 14, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, probably five more levels. Kushiyaki zakana. So grilled fish, sakana is fish. Cook the wood? <laughs> I'll try. Should we cook the fairies? <laughs> eh? Oh wow. You actually can eat that. We should cook the wood. It may be the game changer. You are right. Let's cook all this wood. It could save our lives. I did not know you could cook wood. Let's see if you can cook two at once. Or if it's more effective, just do one at a time. Oh no, it's a, a waste to cook two at once because it's only a quarter hard. Well, now we know what we need to do. We need to chop down all these trees and cook all the wood.
This could make all the difference. This is high level gaming right here. This may be what it takes. Can you bomb to save weapons? We can, but uh... The axe is kind of what this is for. And we have another axe on the ground that we can pick up. So... I'm okay with using it a bit. <laughs> so nah. We do what we must. Ooh, and we got, we got a acorn too. So you never know. That was high level. Ooh, two wood. There's a branch on the ground. Yeah, I don't think we can cook the branch though. Otherwise, I would take it. Yeah, that's a weapon. If we could cook the branch, obviously, we would have to do that. Because this high-level technique was taught to us by Frankie. <laughs> Same with that leaf there. If we could cook the leaf, clearly we would do that. Do you think cooking the wood could in any, any way be a metaphor for learning Japanese? Because I'm trying to think of how it could be, but I can't really think of a good way. But there must be a way, right? I'm trying to think about how to make everything into a... ...metaphor for learning Japanese. I don't know if we'll cook all this wood, but let's cook some of it. <laughs> Let's just break down what this says. Kata sugi. So katai means hard, and sugi, something you can add to a, an adjective, to a, I mean, it's too much of something, so it's too hard. Kata sugi ryori. So it's cooking that's too hard. Nanika yurete wa ikenai mono mazete shimatta. So yeah, something that you should not put in food was mixed in. Chotto hito ni wa. Dasenai yori. Um, say ni, uh, hara wa kaerare nai toki ni wa kajiru shikanai. Yeah, I'm not totally sure on the expression in this last part, but kajiru shikanai. So that means you can do nothing but bite this when probably there's nothing else to eat. That kind of idea. Ah, Dreamweaver! Konnichiwa! Oh, we had a Dreamweaver, now we have a Dream Proxy. Genki desu yo! Genki desu ka? How are you doing? Right now we're cooking wood. High level time in Japanese Quest. Each of these cures one quarter of health. So it could make all the difference. We found like 12. So what is that? Like three hearts? That's significant. This is high level gaming. That's such a good sound for cooking wood. I don't even understand how this is edible, but it is. You think it might be food, like bad food in a toe jam and earl that like takes away your health, but no, it actually helps your health. Anyone who's played toe jam and earl knows what I'm talking about. Eating charcoal is good for you? I guess that's what this is. You'll be ready after this. Greg says, I, I recall that game. If they ever have a game like that in Japanese, I might have to play it just for nostalgia purposes. Uh, 
When I was a kid, the game I was most into is Sega Genesis. Or the system I was most into. Ah, it's Kaleta. Naruhoro. You could stay. You could stay because I. Okay, now we are ready. So let's cook up these acorns as well. Yosh, this is actually good. Natsu <laughs> tsukume. So, plate of nuts. Oishi desu ne. The power of charcoal. Yeah, look at all this charcoal we have. Oishi Now we are ready. Unknown MMO. Ah! Okaeri. Welcome back. All right, so where are we? We get, we are now ready because we have all these dishes. Each of them cures one quarter of health. This is from cooking, literally cooking wood. This is high level techniques. We may need it because we're now going in the deepest depths of this trial of the sword. Yosh, ikimasho. Okay, so let's double check what we have. So let's get a decent sword. Decent bow, decent shield. We got our armor. We got our fairies. We're ready, and we got our time lock. Sa! Ikimashou! Are we missing anything? Let's quick check. Nani mo nai. Here we go. Ah, daijoubu desu yo. No problem, MMO. I will be... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so, um, I'm gonna pause it for a sec just to... So what is happening right now? We got a whole bunch of these guys. Let's have a strategy meeting. <laughs> What should we do right now? So we're on level 12. We can barely see that blurry there. Ice blocks? Yeah, I was thinking ice blocks is one way. Um, Because these guys are pretty weak. Run around and throw bombs. If we can get elevated, that could be good. It looks like there might be cover over here. Saksen Kagi. This is a strategy meeting. Saksen Kagi. Yeah, yeah. I didn't. I said that even before you wrote it, Okamijin. Saksen means strategy, and then Kagi means meeting. So Saksen Kagi. kagi. Uh, dodge everything. That looks fairly impossible. Uh, they can't hit you if you keep moving. Yeah, let's hope that's true. Let's look for cover to the left, maybe, and then just play it by ear. Uh, and bomb them, take them out with one hit. So yeah, they do hit us then. But they're weak. Let's just tear them up. I think we can eat all of our uh, charcoal and get healed from this battle. Let's just eat all our charcoal after this battle and we can be back to normal. I forget what Daisy's stream. Uh, currently? 
Well, it says on the schedule. It's probably the easiest way to see is look at the, the countdown timer. Okay, it is now time to eat some charcoal. Katasugi ryori o tabemashou. Oishi. Yeah, Abnition, thanks for writing the, the the times there. Right now it's 8 p.m. Central, but next week though, we'll be streaming earlier. We'll switch to a a summer time frame. So we'll do some earlier and some later streams. Oishi desu yo. This is a great idea. We're completely healed now from this trial. This one is actually super easy. They like do no damage. And we at least have some armor now. That probably would have been a bit better if we had used a shield, maybe. But I just don't use a shield, usually. Ooh, treasure! Takara. So that was actually incredibly easy. I hope the other ones are that easy. <laughs> well, we're healed now. Ah, yatta. Kinoya. Got some wooden arrows. Where's the schedule? It's on the Twitch page in a couple different spots. You can see it in the app that shows like the countdown timer. Um, also, if you look down further on the page, the schedule is written out. So if you look on the Twitch page, if you look around, you'll you'll find the schedule. But yeah, basically it's five days a week. Uh, North American time, it's pretty much every day at 8 p.m. Central. Yep. So yeah, if you just look around the Twitch page, you can find it. If you're watching on YouTube, you can just jump over there and watch. Check it out. So that worked really well with the charcoal, actually. Yosh, ikimashou. Uh, so I see a question from Okomijin. Yeah, katasugi means too hard. So kata, katasugi, too hard. And yeah, there, notice there is no ru there. Just katasugi yori. Yeah, it means it's too hard, too tough. Yosh, ikimashou. I like that, uh, Saksen Kaigi. So level 13, looks like more... Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. what, what? I thought this is the same ones, but these ones are tougher. Chototo Abunai. And we're on ice for some reason. Alright, that kind of worked. Don't really know if we need that spear, but it might be better than something. Run and drop bombs. That's my strat for everything. Yeah, and time freeze. But yeah, I agree with you there. Naifu looks better than Spear. Oh, we have another space now, though. The Bomberman strategy? <laughs> so, so what weapon should we use now? Maybe a Guardian Spear? They are Guardians, after all. 
So this is actually incredibly easy compared to what the, we have been doing. Which is kind of odd because we're deeper now. Uh, we defeated it. And if you watch the stream of it, it was terrible. It took a long time. It was by far the most challenging boss anything that we face in game. Yosh. Yo 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 yo. So it's odd that we're deeper now and these are way easier than any challenge in the earlier parts. It's very odd. Makes me think there will be a harder one coming up. Uh so I feel like I'd rather have this. Yosh. Ikimasho, let's make sure we're properly equipped. Oh, there's treasure. Good call. Thank you. Arigato. I almost forgot. Yeah, you can hear the treasure with our treasure tracker. Takarawa doko. Thank you for keeping me on point with the treasure. Eh? Doko desu ka? Anyone know how we get there? Seems like it might be on top. Look for something metal or something we can move, I guess. Ah, yep, buddy. Something strange. That is a good time to have tracking on. Ooh, so it's like a double arrow bow. We might as well get that and throw something. Yeah, I never really use it either, but... It wasn't my idea. I read a couple tips. I didn't read the read-through of this trial or like how to do it, but a couple tips that I saw were buffing yourself with extra hearts or like attack power or whatever, and then using treasure tracker. It seemed like a good idea. But I did not want to see the walkthrough because I didn't want to get spoiled on what's going to be down here. But I thought at least a few tips, so they're not completely terrible, might be helpful. Plus, it's just fun to find treasure, so that's a good suggestion. All right, so let's go to time freeze, and again, we got a bow, we got a sword, Ikimasho. So if the trend continues, it might be a bigger guardian now. Okay, so we're at level 14. That means we have two more, 15 and 16, I think. Uh, so it looks like we have lasers up there. So maybe arrows? Saksen Kaigi. Any other ideas? So I'm thinking, I only see these guys. Yade Uchimasho. We can shoot them with arrows or something. There might be other guys in the wings or further back in. Wakana. What do you think? Sa. Itemio. We probably should just go and find out, I guess. Because we can't see that much yet. Ooh, we got a lot.
Okay, so we got a guardian shield, so I think we can deflect these with that. That might be good. Ah. Yo, you, yo, you. Whoa. Eh? Mara. I could have sworn this guy was dead, but he's not. Nande. I think we use this sword a lot, so I don't use this up. You get old. Oh, I see some treasure down there. There's... I wonder if I was hitting a shield the other time. Yatta. So I think just two more floors. And that one's not too bad either. Some nice guardian shields. Takara Geto Zanshin no Tachi. Ooh, that's a nice sword. 32. Ah, Carlos! Yokozo! Japanese Quest away. Welcome to Japanese Quest. We now have a new party member that can help us loot this area before we go down to the next level. Welcome. And let's also think about this. Let's find some new words in Japanese. Increase this power level, perhaps before we meet the boss down here. Whoops. Sorry, Carlos. Took your head off for a second there. Let's loot this area. Oh, we can't take that? That's the problem. We need that. So now we have the sword, Carlos. For now, you can hold this sword. So, Sensei, what are we going to play next Monday? My thoughts actually for next Monday are, I want to start the morning time, and I'm thinking I might start it on Monday. So in the morning, Stardew Valley, at the normal time, Xenoblade 2, cutscenes. That is the plan. So I'm actually planning to stream two times on Monday. The first week, I kind of want to just get a schedule with going in the morning so I can actually wake up at that time. So that is the plan. Stardew Valley, 8 a.m. Xenoblade 2, 8 p.m. So this is a time that can work for the EU a bit better, and then a time that's later on that has a more language focus with Xenoblade 2. So there'll be a lot of reading and a lot of voiced dialogue. Okay, any other treasures? I don't think so. Night is night. Guardian knife. It's kind of a nice thing. Let's get that. Hmm. Don't really know if we need a torch at this point, but we probably don't. I think we're done with the dark. And if we do need it, they'll probably give us a torch. Yosh. Let's go to the next level. All right, so what do we have? We've got a bow. We've got a sword. Guardian shield. Perhaps a guardian weapon might be in order. Huh. 
Huh. I'm not really sure what this does. But I can, we can read it. Finish you blow. So it's like finishing blow. What does that do? Finish blow. Oh, is this just more damage than usual? I don't know. Cause it's like I noticed this one has the swords. This one doesn't. But their attack is the same. Well, can I? So I'm thinking the next level might have a, like a real guardian. Possibly. And I think we're ready. Critical hit? I didn't even know there is critical hit in this game. Eh? What does crit crit critical hit do? Yosh, ikimashou. Let's do this. Two more levels. It's not getting easier. Gamarimasu. Rue, good timing. We will need the hype. Okay, strategy meeting. Okay, we are level 15. Just two more levels. Thank you for the dragon hype. Let's think of a strat. So we have two looks like basic small guardians. Can easily beat them with the sword or just our shield. Because we do have the guardian shield now. Uh, so we could just bounce those back. Since we can't see anything else, might as well just do that. Yosh. Thank you for all the dragon hype, everyone. Let me put some dragon in there, too, as we take these guys down. And I can't kind of believe how easy it's been so far, but I guess I shouldn't speak too soon. Because, who knows, we could just get killed right here. Oh, wait, what? They woke up. I was wrong. These are the bigger ones. Eh, not anyway. Oh. Yeah, these guys are legit. Eh, was it Kaji? We got hurt. Yeah, these guys are tougher, for sure. Yeah, it'd be good if we just get them to go into the pillars like usual. I think if we just kind of weave, it might be the best thing. Let's eat some garbage really quick though. Time to eat charcoal. I knew there's a reason we made all this charcoal. We made this by cooking wood, by the way, anyone who wasn't here. <laughs> we literally cooked a bundle of wood for each one. Because you never know, you might need it. Whoa, whoa, whoa he's doing something different. That's bad. Hmm. He died. Okay, gotta kill this guy. We got plenty of arrows, so we might as well use them. Yosha! Kachimashita! Not too bad, really, though. So I'm guessing a, a full guardian will be the next one. And if, it, if this is all it is, it's not too bad, hopefully. But those guys can possibly one-shot you, so it could be a lot worse. Let's see. Let's get some weapons. We got a guardian knife and... Guardian Axe. We definitely want the Axe. We probably want all of it. Since we're probably going to be facing a Guardian. Hmm. 
Hmm. At this point, we probably don't need our axe. Because we're about to fight a boss. The boss of this entire thing, I think. Is there any treasure here? Eh, Nidus got. Guardian Lance. Hmm, probably want the Lance over these things. Okay, so final level, the boss, and we have some decent swords. Ken this name. Ken is sword in Japanese. Ken. We've got a club, Kon Bolt, Sue. We've got two two wands. Bigger Kon Bolt. And we've got some bigger swords. Axes. Ono is axe. I think we're ready for the final challenge here. Ganbarimas. Are we missing anything? Let's quick check. <laughs> Nani mo nai. Okay, let's heal up for the final boss. Let's eat our last charcoal. Top it. We can eat our acorns. Or wait, is there something that gives us two hearts though? We could use all of our hearts back. Oh no, we need more charcoal to eat. Okay, I think we're ready. Daijobu kana. Maybe a better shield. Ikimasho. Bosu desu yo. Time for the boss. We don't know what it will be, but it's probably, if the trend holds, it will be a, like the biggest kind of guardian. Maybe a one on one with a guardian, or a one on two even with a guardian. Probably not two, but who knows. We will see. Ikimasho. Gamarimas, let's get some dragon hype in the chat for this final level. It's taken a long time, streaming today and yesterday to get here. Yup, buddy. Boss of this ne. Final level. Yup, buddy ne. Okay, so it's one of these normal kind of boss guardians from the trials. It looks like it's just one. Any strategy ideas? It looks like the things to note, we have pillars. Hashida in Japanese. Hashida ga arione. Um, we could freeze him. That could be good. Let's do that. Whoa! He took a quick turn. Okay, let's uh, let's add something. We want to heal, plus we might as well do an attack buff. Okay, let's try to get him to hit this as usual. And perhaps we want a stronger weapon. Spit on this guy. Whoa, what? What? Nande? Wrong pillar. This really shouldn't be too bad, actually, unless he freaks out somewhat. Wait, it will not be expected. He's gonna break that pillar, isn't he? Oh no, good. Hey, what? Keep breaking the wrong pillar. At least get some hits on him. You know you wanted to hit that pillar.
Probably not the best timing there, but... Will he just hit us? That's not good. Try to take his back. Okay, we lost that. We might as well top off our health just in case. Top edit. Top edit. Nigero. This guy's got some hit points, unlike the other ones. Shooting now? Yeah, he's gonna shoot with. He's gonna do the uh, spinny spin, so let's shoot him with some nice arrows. Might as well use all our bomb arrows and electric arrows. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What just happened? Let's change arrows. And change bows. Stronger anyway. And how's our weapon right now? We have no weapon. Probably not good. Oh, here we go again. So it seems like he was stunned by the electric arrows. Let's try ice next. Cause these don't carry over. Might as well use all of them. Let's end this. Oh no, it broke. That's not good. I guess we used it a lot before. I don't know if we can spin with this weapon or not. Okay, I feel like this weapon doesn't spin, so... Maybe just Guardian Knife plus? Yosha, Mikaso. Yup, da. Let's get some dragon hype up in here. I see a lot of dragons already. We have defeated the second trial, and it was not easy. Yup, does it. Yup, da. It was only the third try, and the second try got messed up because. When I was looting, I accidentally failed to get any bow or arrows. <laughs> so not too bad, really. Now all that's left is the final Trial of the Sword, which probably will be impossible. But the last part of this was actually easier than the first two parts, in my opinion. The dark part was harder. I actually think the part with the wind was the hardest part. Tanoshikata, any treasure or anything? I think that is the end. Yosh! Thank you, Anta. Thank you for the dragon hype. Everyone else, thank you for the dragon hype. Yatta. Dekimashita. I really thought I would die today, but this section ended up being much easier than expected. The part with the guardian in the dark was much scarier. Yatta.
back to the Final Fantasy chamber. You who is chosen by the sword, you've done well to overcome this trial. Now we'll give you even more power of the Master Sword. To the sword. Yup, uh, yeah, it was all about the wood, Frankie. Thanks for that tip. Touch the Master Sword. Forget it, to touch. And don't fall off. Do you think we can die here? Should we try? Let's vote on if we should try to jump off right here. <laughs> no, let's not. <laughs> Who's soda still? I'm not jumping off. <laughs> she need to I? Although, what if you jump down there and just like in Toe Jam and Earl, there's like a secret island where you could get lemonade that would heal you? How sweet would that be? True, there's only one way to find out. <laughs> I almost did it. I can't do it though. I, I'm pretty sure if we jumped off, we'd probably just take some damage and come back. But I'm not going to risk it. So the verb here. Nuku. To remove. To pull out. Yup, up. Mapu pin. So it's telling you about the the map pins. Oh, check this out. We got this new power on the loading screen. I never noticed that. Bike, are you on does that mean that last beast we were in was like a giant motorcycle? Why are we still naked? Mm. Oh. I guess because I, I think we were naked. Modotaka, you came back. So same thing as he said before. So you came back, Mororu, to come back. And then, Hitomori. So like one level more tough. We look like we're like one level tougher now. Uh, the adjective here, Takumashi, is to be like tough or like brawny. And then Natta, to become that. Takamashi kunatta. Imano nushi ga furu master sword wa izen yori mo iryoku o mashite yoru hazu. So now the master sword that you swing, it should be even more powerful. Yatta goju. Power up pushed mashita. So the Master Sword now has powered up. Now we're definitely ready for Ganon with this sword. Does anyone know? Does this power powered up, if it is glowing, will it be like more than 60 or is it still capped at 60? Because normally when it glows, it gets stronger and it goes up to 60. But that, it starts at 30. So I'm wondering if we start at 50, will it still only go to 60 or will it go to like 75 or something like that? Anyone know that? I don't I have no idea. Hmm. So if you want to become even more powerful. So you can challenge this trial of the sword again. Okay, we've seen this a couple times. Why don't we add this sentence today? Because this is really what the past couple streams have been about. Challenging this trial of the sword. 
And that's what it talks about here. Tsurugi no Tameshi, the trial of the sword. Or Tsurugi no Shiren. And then Idomu is to challenge. So if you can, let's try to write this here. We can add this sentence to our Japanese quest chronicle. All the sentences we find that seem like a key sentence in this game on this journey across all the games we play. So Saranaru, even more. And then Tsuyoki Chikara. So even more powerful. Even more strength. So Chikara is power. And then Tsuyoi is strong. But uh, sometimes the E changes to a key. You often see that when reading. I've often seen it like when reading light novels and things. Um, so if you if you seek even more power, this verb here, um, motomeru, means to seek. So if you seek even more power, tsurugi no tomeshi ni idomu. So you can challenge this trial of swords. Idomu to challenge. Idomu no de areba. So if you challenge this trial of swords. By the way, this is an N1 word. I remember it was on the N1 quiz on the website, I think. Idomu to challenge. So if you learn this word, you got an N1 word under your belt. Idomu to challenge something. Uh, looks like Dreamweaver has it, and it looks like Gade has it as well. Let's do a quick read. Um, Saranaru uh, tsuyoki chikaro wo motome. Tsurugi no tameshi ni idomu no ga no de areba. Yatta, dekimashita ne. So that looks correct. Let's unlock this sentence. That is the sound of it being unlocked in our collective subconscious. Let's try one more time for Gade who wrote it too. Yosh. Now let's copy and paste that and add it to our Japanese Quest Chronicle, which by the way, our sentence list is linked in the uh, language arts section of the Twitch page. Language arts. Ima nanji. Right now it's Kuchihan. So it's nine o'clock, 9.30. And for anyone just joining, the reason we have this uh, Triforce here, anyone who's on YouTube or something can look for this Triforce symbol to know we learned this sentence here, we kind of analyzed it, analyzed it in more detail. So it's a visual cue and that uh, unlock sound is the audio cue. I think we can have the dragon go, go for now. Yosh. So, mo ichiro sono daiza ni Master sword wo sashimurosu no dozo no dozo. So this is kind of part of the same sentence. So don't we add this one too? We can add it on a different line of the sentence because it's quite long. Uh, but let's add this. They can go in order, and I'll break this down too. So mo means it's kind of a set phrase here. Mo ichido means one more time. Mo ichido. You can say that just by itself for one more time. So, mo ichiro sono daiza ni. So, one more time on this pedestal. Master sword o. So, o marking the master sword as the object. Sashi morosu. So, you can insert the master sword back in here if you want to do the trial again. So, yeah, if we can write this one too, we can uh, finish out that sentence. Gamaro. And yeah, let's look at the keywords here. Let me mark the words that we have already, I think, on Japanese Quest in yellow and the ones we don't in red. So, mo, already we have. Ichido, I'm not sure. So, I'll mark that red and yellow. Um, Daiza, we definitely don't have, like a pedestal. Master Sword, not really a probably word we need to learn as a set thing. It's kind of for this game. Um, Sasu. To stab, we learned. Sasu, to insert. Different kanji we didn't learn, but I'll just put yellow for that one. Um, modosu, I don't think we did learn that. I think we learned modoto to return, possibly. So Dream Reaver has this sentence, too, and it looks right. So let's unlock that one, too. Chotto matte. Yatta. So let's copy and paste that one as well. And again, it's about the same time. Kuchihan. 9.30. Thank you so much for writing that. So we're able to unlock this sentence. Yosh.
やったできましたね So it's 9:30. I think that might mean it is time to save and to go for the final challenge. And it must be super hard because the other one started out really hard. It kind of got easier at the end, weirdly, but we need to die again. This time, let's die the other way. We voted today. We voted the other the other day how we would die. This time, let's just die the old-fashioned way. Bakudande. Bakudan is bomb. Shinu is to die. So if you say Bakudan de Shinu. Die by bomb. We must die before we can live. Jaga Imore. Yes, the power of potatoes. Yatta. So that's the reason we did this. Now we have Ichi, Ni, San, Shi, Go. We got three, five more hearts because of the power of.、Uh, Mifa, she's protecting us. She said Momoru to protect. So we have that. We got our tracking. I think we're ready to go. After we save. Because if we die, we want to start right here again. Save. Yosh. Ikimashou. Sasu. To insert, to stab. So now we are going for. We can finally unlock it. Kyokui. The final trial. The advanced trial. What do they call it in English? The,、uh, the final challenge? Something like that. Gamoro. Daijobu kana. Good, good, very good timing, McClo. <laughs> Moody.、Uh, that could be a bad omen. Just. Iyana yokan ga shimas. Juka Tib says, "Plug it in, plug it in." We're on the final challenge, so we need we need any hype we can get. Watch us be attacked immediately. Eh? Nani kore? So you who has been chosen by the sword in the name of the goddess Hylia, we give you this the sword challenge. Yeah, I don't know, Rue. That's what I was asking before. I don't know if it, if, buff, if it buffs you anymore. So you'll be challenged in body and spirit to bring out the, the true glow of this sword. So anything can happen here. And all of your items have been lost. Does not go past 60, really? It's too bad. It should go up a little bit, I feel like. Whoa, 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 okay. So it looks like we have a skeleton situation. So I'm thinking bombs might actually be good right now. Because、um, we have no weapons. I see one weapon over there. Yosh. Whoa, 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 we got. Lightning? Abunaisyo. Oh, those lightning points, it looks like they have lightning specifically. This is very odd. I don't like this lightning because it could kill us. This guy's like right tracking me. Where's this guy's head? Whoa! Boy. Eh? Atama wa doko? Daijobu ka? Yosh. Did not go past 60? That's kind of 
kind of lame. Alright, let's not go until we loot. We learned that the hard way last time. And let's avoid all this lightning. Because that could kill us. All these weird, weird weapons we're getting. Ah, oh, yeah. Go cut the thumbnail. So we do have a bow and arrow now, at least. Oh, that thing is gonna. Tracks lightning, isn't it? I think we can take it. Just not equip it. Ooh. Kino ya times five. Another Kino ya. Kino ya. Wooden arrow. Another sword. Abonet. These challenges would be much easier if it wasn't for the environmental factors that make it dangerous. Like the wind before, and the lightning here, and the water in the first place. The darkness. Outside of that, it's not really that bad, actually. Oops. Sixty to all times. Huh, that's kind of too bad. You think it should still get some kind of buff, but oh well. Hope we don't get hit by lightning up here. Whoa, what? I thought that just hit us. Yeah, we have terrible weapons. But at least we have something. Hope we didn't miss anything. So perhaps the way these themes seem to be, it might be more skeletons. Or not. I really don't like these bats at all. Any time freeze these guys? That works. Yeah. Eh? Is there nothing in there? Do we just blow up a bunch of stuff? Oh well. It's odd. Res 
spamming time freeze in this guy. I really don't want to get hit by them because those guys can hurt. So where is the enemy? Ah, yep, buddy. Dropped it for some reason. That's endured. Yosh. Cut that. Add to our arsenal of arms. So far, so good. There's treasure somewhere, we can hear it. <laughs> Sugoi. Check out these arms are boomerangs, which is kind of awesome. Lizard arms actually are boomerangs. It's just a tree that fell. We might want it to cook it later. What do you think? We can do without it. I don't know where this treasure is. What is it? What is it? Yosh. Ooh, that is a nice sword. Kine no Ken. So that's like the advanced, like the elite defense sword. Suge. Not bad. Good thing we had the tracker on for that one. That was hard to see. Let's save that one for a proper battle. That's actually really well hidden. You can barely see it with the little orange. Almost there. Almost to the bottom. Maybe. Probably not quite yet. Sankai. So, level 3. Can see some electric choo choo, some kind of treasure.
Looks like we have an electricity theme around here. Choto koine. Could go arrow. Might be safer with those guys. Don't really trust fighting these guys. So where are the skeletons, is the question. There's no one here. What is the deal here? Oh. Kishino Tate. So Knight's Shield. That's a nice weapon. See the heads. But I'd rather not waste any more arrows. We don't have very many. That's too close. Their heads. That is the problem. There's a head. More heads. Must find more heads. What? Where are their heads? Seriously. Eh? Give me what on. They're heading for it? Okay. Yosh. Yatta. <laughs> you were right though, Rube. They were heading for it. Yosh. Almost <laughs> dead. That's the kind of language play that's important for, uh, learning a language or even once you've known a language your whole life. <laughs> I'm kind of scared of playing with metal, but hopefully it's okay. Kishino Yumi. So soldier's bow, or knight's bow. Kishi is knight. 
Haste you, soldier. They have both in this game. I don't see any other weapons or anything, but uh, these barrels. Yeah, times five. Got some arrows. We need all the yaw we can get. And all the giant moblin arms we can get. Let's not hit a spike. Or lightning. I think we got most of it. Anything else? あ。yari. So it's a like a spiked moblin spear. Well, we actually can't hold that already. Holy. Too many arms. This thing's about to break too. I guess we probably should have been using a weaker weapon on these guys, because they only take one hit. I think. Ooh, koi. Yosh, ikimashou. So the skeletons seem weak, but they can do a lot of damage if they have good weapons. So this is not a place to let your guard down at all. Oh, especially when they're on horseback. Hmm. Whoa, whoa, whoa a lot of them. First step, get them off horseback. He's not charged yet. <laughs> that works too. Not sure if this is a good strategy. It is not! Whoa, what just hit us? That was bad. See, this is how you can die in a real hurry. Their horse now? What happened? Where are their heads? Atama wa doko da okashi yo. Konnichiwa. No, 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 no. That's bad. 
That's very bad. Yeah, these guys are no joke. We may die. Because now we have no weapon. Must get out of water. Wow, there's a lot of guys here. My advice, don't get on the skeleton oars. It might not turn off turn out like you think it will. Abunakata. So that one was dangerous, unlike the first ones, it didn't seem that bad. We better heal up. You're now out of food. Not a good place. Probably have enough arms at this point. Could probably stand to lose a few. Whoa, that thing better not kill us. Or shinobi dake. So that's a uh, like ninja shroom. Helps you be more stealthy. Where's the other box? I was wondering where, where they got these electric arrows. That was the source of their power. I really hope those skeleton horses can't attack us. Whoa, whoa, whoa get away. I don't trust you. That's probably everything. I don't sense any treasure anywhere. Ooh, there's a mushroom there. Yeah, guru guru can mean, yeah, turning round and round. Like guru guru mawaru. That's the song we took it from. Guru guru mawaru to spin round and round. Uppity lemon. By the way, yokozo! Japanese quest away. Welcome to Japanese quests. Yeah, we're doing our best on this channel. I'm a Japanese teacher. Trying to teach Japanese in a different way through Japanese video games. And the way we do that, we collect words, we collect sentences and analyze them, 
throughout the games. And down here you can see all the words from past games. This one we actually learned from my cat here, Griffin Sensei. Griffin Sensei has a power level of one, only knows one Japanese word, and this is the word Nyan, meaning meow. Nyan. But our power level on Japanese Quest is 830. But that can go up as we learn more Japanese words. Yokozo, welcome. Ishoni, Damoro. Together, let us level up in the game and in Japanese. It's always good to have a new lemon around. We could use the power of a lemon. Okay, so where are we going? Let's get this ready. So, Roku, you can lock time basically. Gamorimasu, thank you, Ru. Gambare just means like do your best. That's what Ru said there. Gambare. You can say Gambarimasu, I will do my best. Okay, let's get equipped with something. Ikimasho. I'm guessing it'll get more scary from here on out. Because that level was a lot harder already. Yep, this is what I was thinking pretty much. Okay, um. Strategy meeting. Saksen kaigi. Saksen means strategy. Kaigi means meeting. Saksen kaigi. So I'm thinking the main things here time freeze, shoot arrow in eye, uh, possible, then just swaling on him. But in the end, you need to kill his eye. Ah! Yokozo! Japanese quest away. Welcome to Japanese quest. We could use your help on this boss, so any strategies, any ideas in Japanese or English, or questions in Japanese or English, feel free. They could be about the game or about the language. Let's do our best here. So I'm thinking we want our strongest bow. That's not gonna, like, kill us with electricity. Ah! Arigato! Ureshii! Let's level up with Japanese from here on out. Yeah, that's kind of what we're trying to do, be something a little bit different. I didn't see a channel quite like this on Twitch, so that's why I decided to make it earlier this year. Especially the kind of words that we collect as we go. As far as I know, it's never really been done before, so it's kind of an experiment. We'll have to hear from feedback if it is helpful to people. Hopefully it's helpful to people because compiling these words has taken some time, but it's cool. These are all the words we found in earlier games. So like Mayo to get lost, we learned in the uh, the lost forest in this game. And this path kind of goes with it. Michi ni Mayo to get lost. That's how you say I, I got lost. Okay, but right now we got to focus on this guy here. So let's do our best. What, he's getting a tree? Don't get a tree. Okay, stronger weapon, stronger weapon. Okay, what do we got? Um, this is our strongest club. I think we need to damage him, so let's try it. You get all... That was close. It's not going too well. He's got some weapons stuck into his hindquarters. Did you see that? Yo, Katta. Good to hear you're learning some stuff, even when we're fighting this giant skeleton ogre. It seems like time freeze arrow is really the way to go with this guy. Because he is pretty slow. Whoa, fail. I guess you do have a bit of elevation here, too. But he might not like when you're at elevation. I find if you just kite them more, running from them, they tend to not be as dangerous. Where is he? There he is. Need 
Hey, get all... Yeah, it reminds me of EQ kiting. Whoa, whoa, he's throwing ribs at us. This is bad. That does a lot of damage. I think if you go horizontally, he won't hit you with his ribs. He has less ribs now, though, so that's good, maybe. Ah, uh, he just dodged it. You okay, top? Yeah, it's basically a tooth car, or like a tooth wheel, because it can be a wheel. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Don't throw ribs at us. You need your ribs to be healthy. Whoa! What? What? <laughs> For some reason, I was trying to do time freeze, but it didn't work. That was not ideal. Okay, there's the eyeball. Let's hit it. Can we time freeze his eyeball? All right, I think we're getting there, but we need something that's not gonna summon lightning. No, he's getting his eye back. That's bad. I should have time frozen his eyeball. There we go. Why is his eyeball so strong? You get all I feel like he's gonna kill me. We must not get hit by this guy. Oh no, is he gonna take his ribs out? Don't take your ribs out. Here we go. Yup, da. Let's get some dragon hype for taking this guy down. Hopefully we can heal up after this. Whoa, I'm not gonna get exploded, will I? Yup, da. Not bad. Let's just not hit, get hit by lightning and die right now. So I don't know if those summon fire, but looks like we can get all of those. Check it out. Elemental weapons. We can learn the elements. Kaen. Flame. Then Yadi. So Kaen no Yadi. Flame spear. Raiden no Tsurugi. It's a lightning sword. Hyosetsu no Taiken. So a great sword of ice. Kakui desu ne. So have we seen any words in game? Because we should make our power level go up. I don't think we've added a word yet today. What words should we add? Oh, there is some treasure. Ooh, and there's something here, too. Ah, sige. A lot more arrows, which we need after that battle. Hyosetsu. Yeah, that's... I feel like that's a compound that we probably don't need to learn, but... Because we, we have a, both of those originally. But yeah, that's definitely a word we don't have. Not a super common word, though. But good suggestion. It's always good to see it in chat. Yeah, you don't see it a lot. Outside of this game, I haven't really seen it either. No, it's, it's good to even say the word, even if you're not suggesting it, because we just get exposure. But yeah, thanks for saying it. Where is the treasure? Takarawa. And I, I see no treasure. Up here, I guess. I really wish we were like not in this lightning plan anymore, so hopefully this lightning will end. Lemon. I think you can say it just in katakana. Oh, it looks like it's just buried here. And it's metal. Yeah, someone could write, write for your chat, probably. I'll put a lemon. Yeah, we actually could add that word, though. We could use the power of lemon on this journey. Thank you, Okomijin. Lemon. Lemon. Kori no ya. So, ice arrow. 
So now that three people wrote it, why don't we power up with the power of lemon today? Uh, we don't have it. All words are fair game if we don't have it. Let's show you how we power up on Japanese Quest. So right now, Goku is doing one hand push-ups, getting the power of Guzen, coincidence. That's the word for coincidence, Guzen. But let's change that today. It's been like that for a while. Chotomate. Uh, now he will gain the power of lemons. There we go. Should be good. You can see now Goku is gaining the power of lemons. Let's go to our dictionary. Jisho. Just type in lemon in English or Japanese works. Lemon. As you can see, it's a common word, so it's a good one for us to learn. We're trying to mostly learn common words, and they they mark there if they're common, which is very helpful. Common is more or less the, the first 20,000 or so words, I believe, is how they index it. So let's copy it to our clipboard using the Rikai plugin, Rikai Kun plugin for Google, and let's make our power level go up. So now we have the power of lemons. That crazy kanji that she wrote. Yeah, you don't need to know this kanji. I did not know this kanji. That's a kanji that you don't really see. It's almost always in katakana. Yeah, lemon tree, that kanji means. Interesting. But these ones are super rare. As you can see, they're not in the top 3,000 kanji. It's kind of hard to see, but I can see on there from the indexing. So we now have the power of lemons unlocked. Not just the word, but the power of lemons on Japanese Quest from now on. We can summon lemons. Let me show you how that looks. So you see Link over there. Now, if he wants, he can put a lemon on his arrow. This is the power of the subconscious. You can summon things from your mind. The power of lemons is now summoned. Okay, what other words should we add? We must, we gotta think of some words we've been seeing today. Are there any more weapons? Let's add club, because we have been talking about more weapons like konbo. Let's learn all the weapons we've been seeing at least. So konbo, club, let's add club. So ice, we already have ice. Kori. We definitely have that one, but good suggestion. We have ice and snow. Yuki is snow, and then Kori is ice. Uh, wood? Uh, we have wood. Um, ki is tree and wood, so we do have that. But good suggestions. It's always good to make a suggestion even if we have it, because then more people can learn it if they don't know it yet. Uh, so I'm pretty sure we have wood and ice and kind of basic things, because we are at 830. We've learned a lot of words now. So we got to dig a little deeper, and it's kind of trickier. Let's look at our weapons down here. Uh, maybe something having to do with bones. We do have hone for bone, I believe. Um, omocha. Did we see that in-game, Gare? Or is that just an idea? Yeah, omocha toy. Could be a good word. Let's add that if we uh, don't find any other words related to the game. Undedo, yeah. Something related to undead could be good, because we're seeing a lot of undead. Let's add some undead type words. Uh, so we have hone, bone. We learned that already. But how about something else? Yeah, good to throw things out there. Uh, we could add rusty, because we're getting a lot of rusty weapons. Like sabiru. Yeah, that could be a good one, Rue. The one you just wrote right there. Let's just type in skeleton, see what we get. I don't think we have that word. So kokaku is kind of the skeleton or framework. That's not really the one I'm looking for, though. This is the one that Ru wrote. Why don't we write that? Skeleton. Gaikotsu. That's a good word. Ah! We got a dragon! Yokozo! Welcome, Artorio Pendragon. Good to see you. Yeah, Sabi could be good for rust. Let's add skeleton, though. Because we're fighting a lot of skeletons today. So Gaikotsu, skeleton. And, uh... We've seen a lot of rust, so like, just type in rust and let's see what we see. So sabi is rust, and two word. Sabiru, to become rusty. And that's a verb. We could just learn both. Because it's two different words, both and two words. It's the noun and the verb. Ah, uh, you're looking up sentences? Yep. We, we got some sentences earlier, but we haven't learned words yet. So let's see. We are up to 33. Why don't we just do rust and to rust? Both. Suna, we did add that. Sand. 
we have that already. Notice Akasabi, also rust. Aka means red, so like red rust. Kanasabi, here is the kanji for metal, so it's like rusted metal. Now you're getting the weird stuff the deeper you go. Sand seal? It's not really, it's kind of like a created word for this game. We do have the word for seal, I think, already. Like the word for the animal seal, I believe. Um, let's just go with rust for today. And yeah, any other words? So sabi. Ah! Metrion! Yokoso! Japanese Quest away. Welcome to Japanese Quest. You're here just in time as we're we are leveling up with the power of rust. Most things just decay when they rust. When uh, we learn the word for rust, we actually get stronger. So we go the other way. We power up with all the words that normally power you down. We power up with the words that power you up too. We're like absolute value, negative and positive, become a positive. It's kind of like the Aikido of language. So what do we have today? Lemon. We got the power of lemon because we got a new party member that is literally named... What was it again? Something with lemons. Uh, Kondo, club. Gaikotsu, skeleton. Sabi, rust. And then sabiru, to rust. Ru is often added to make it a verb in the plain form. Uh, Ru mentioned numa for like swamp. I think we have that word, don't we, Ru? We do not, we do not have fungi, though. Kinlui, that's kind of a more rare word. Good suggestions, everyone. And now our power level is right now 830. You can see, let's make that power level go up. Chotto matte. Oh, it's like doing weird things because I have it in the Japanese mode. It's doing predictive text. Here we go. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? The scouter says our power level is now 835. Thank you, Nappa, for asking. Uh, we've grown a lot this day. Let's see. Yeah, that's a good suggestion too, Anta. I don't know if we have that word Taiyo Sun. We may have it, but we may not. Okay, so I think we've leveled up all we need to. And I'm really hoping there'll be like a place to cook the next level. That kind of seemed like a boss, didn't it? I checked, we don't. Okay, good to know. Yeah, we should add that. Let's just add it right now. Because Taiyo... The sun is something we need right now because it's raining, and we want that to end. So let's go back to our level up screen, but let's just make sure we don't, don't get struck by lightning. So let's put it in this screen. Taiyo. I think we have that one, Ru. Suki, the moon. We did learn a different word for sun, I believe. Like he, but Taiyo is good to learn too. Taiyo, the sun, N3 words, so middle level in terms of JLPT. The Japanese language proficiency test, it's in the middle level there. So Taiyo, that's what we need right now. Taiyo ga ina. Taiyo, sun or solar. So power level is up again to 836 with Anta's suggestion. Yeah, that's a good word, Ru. Be sunny. What does the scouter say about his power level? Power level is now 836. Let's go to the next level, though. Let's remove the lemon for now. If I die when I'm undoing a lemon, I'll never live it down. There we go. Okay, looks like we're well equipped. Let's go to that, though. Yoshikimajo. No more treasure, right? That's just wood. That's just wood. We don't need it. Hopefully. She'd have better to examine. Ikimajo. Let's go! Yatta! Yap, buddy. So this is a place to rest and cook place we needed very much and they do have a fairy we must get this fairy very important because we missed it last time and it was the worst thing ever yep ah, we got the fairy any more fairies nah does not could have cooked the wood yeah we could have but <laughs> it also would reduce our weapons and right now we don't have that many weapons 
Hmm, we don't have an axe this time, so let's just do this with bombs. We can get wood from all these trees here, maybe, though. Toriniku. Got some chicken. Always good. And we need we need the wood as we know. Wood is good. We can cook wood, we can eat wood. It could be the difference. Wrong chat? Ah, so does God. Are you in another chat too, Dreamweaver? Kukats has just play, started playing this recently. Tanoshi is nah, this game's a lot of fun. We've been playing it for a while now. Hope I just didn't kill a fish. Ah, oh, sakana. Yoroi. So it's like an armor fish. Good kind of fish to get. Eh, doko. Where'd the fish go? Don't tell me the fish disappeared. Oh, there they are. Oh, yeah. It's too fast. Is that all the fish? Yeah, doko means where. Good word, Ru. Eh? Oh, yeah. Okay, I think we got the two fish. Exactly. Got a Hayasugi. Too fast. <laughs> Must get all wood. Yep. Ooh, they do have an axe. But that's kind of like a good axe. What if we blow ourselves up? That'd be the worst. If you're wondering, wondering why we're breaking all the trees, it's because we were taught by Frankie you can cook the wood from the trees and it does heal you and that could be the difference between life and death in these deep deep dungeons yep. so this is simply the logical thing to do when you come to a place like this with those trees So does Nehru. That's the word for to assist, right? Or assistant. The danger here is I could blow myself up. Yep. High level gameplay. Assistant helper, right? Thanks, Ru. Thanks for explaining it. Looks like we have some treasure too. Let's get that. Hiraku. Open, hopefully, some armor. Yatta. Honogado. So it's got a flame guard. Taika no. Ishikutsu. So it's like rock shoes. Let's equip that before we forget. Hiraku. Kishino Yumi, the knight's bow. Nice. Ooh. 
Wow, this makes me think that there's going to be a lot of guardians coming up. Kodai Heiso, ya, times three, because we have three ancient arrows now, which we never had before. But they're incredibly strong on guardians. Kowai ne. That actually scares me more than it makes me feel good. Chotto kowai. Time to cook. Maybe you should take a torch over a random arm. So organizing all our weapons here. We got one really nice sword. Let's do some cooking here. Let's cook some more wood today. Because that's what we do. We got some uh, armor fish. Um, if we hold a bunch, it might give us a big armor buff, so let's try that. This looks like... what else is for armor? Ooh, we actually have a max truffle? Nice. Got some decent food, actually. Yeah, two of them. I saw that guy. That's very helpful. And we actually got the fairy, so item-wise, we're doing okay. But this is the most difficult one, so it's going to get probably super dangerous. Oh, that had a lot more duration, adding that different stuff to it. So it's Suduki Dake. So that should increase attack power, I believe. Probably more than you have outside the trial? Yeah, probably. Let's just do one at a time. That's a max seal right there. Very useful. Yatta. Yori. Jody is cooking, so we're doing a lot of that today. Oh, so does Nah. Wanna cook some wood? But it does heal one quarter of a heart. Again, too hard cooking. Katasugi Yori. Let's cook a bit more here. High level dishes. I love how the charcoal has garnish on it, does it? <laughs> oh yeah, it does. It's got like a little leaf on like a little mint leaf or something on it. <laughs> well, maybe that's what gives you the quarter of a heart. I don't know where we got that leaf out of this bundle of wood though. Maybe you just pick like a leaf from the ground, maybe. That increases your uh, movement speed. Ido means movement. Then Ido Sokudo movement speed. <laughs> I see you looked up the word for to garnish, Rue. Nicely done. So it. Meaning increases our speed. Not bad. Mm -hmm. 
So cooking that with the wood would not be good. So that one gives us some uh, ninja abilities in case we need them. Now it is time to cook wood. This is high level gaming. It could be all the difference. Why you can even cook this, I do not know. Cook several wood? It doesn't work. It, it still will only be quarter of a heart. You gotta do them one at a time. We, I tested it, Rue. I wish we could do that, but it does not increase the health value. So you must do them one at a time. I mean, don't you know how to cook wood properly? <laughs> Gotta cook it by itself. <laughs> uh. 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 Again, we have Katasugi Ryori. Okay, I think we'll actually end the stream there for today. I'll keep one piece of wood to cook next time to get warmed up. And uh, we will stop the stream here today and see what we have in store for us at this, the advanced trial of the sword. So tomorrow again at 8 o'clock, we will stream 8 o'clock central time. So today we will say, Ja! Mata ne! So far, so good. Surprise, this advanced challenge hasn't been that bad yet, but I'm guessing it'll be get, get a lot worse. Gare says, I like a nice oak log smoked over nice aged mahogany. Ah, uh, Phantom Pickle. Kochira koso, arigato. Otsukaisama So, today was fun. Let's host someone and spread some of the fun over to someone else who's playing a game in Japanese or teaching Japanese. Let's see who is streaming today. We'll stream again tomorrow at the same time from 8 o'clock. Ashtamo Hachiji Kara Hashinchimasne. Hmm, let's see. Someone playing a Japanese game. Not always easy to find. Why don't we host Japanglish today? They're playing Star Wars Jedi Knights. It may not be in Japanese, because they are Japanese, but they have really good English. But they do speak a lot of Japanese on their channel too. So let's hope let's host Japanglish today. Playing Star Wars Jedi Knight. Maybe learn some uh, Star Wars words in Japanese. Let's host them, and tomorrow we'll start up again at the same time and deeper into the Trial of the Sword. Ja, mina, mata ashita ne. Ima kara hosto shimasu.